Hey everyone, Vinayak here. So most of you must have heard about Dex, Samsung's desktop experience for Android. I've been getting quite a lot of questions on if you can run Dex without a Dex dock. On Galaxy devices such as the S9 Plus and below, we needed a Dex dock. But I tried it out on my phone and guess what I found. I had done this once earlier, but my device was running Android 8 or Oreo, which didn't seem to work, even if I connected power to the hub. Now that the device has been updated to Android 9 or Peppermint, I've been hearing that it works without a desktop. The hub I'm using is the Artis USB 2 HDMI hub, which I have reviewed earlier. You can see the video by clicking on the link on the top left. So first I'm connecting the HDMI port from my monitor to the hub. Then I'm connecting the USB-C port to the phone and switch to the appropriate input on the monitor. And what's this? A notification for Dex on the phone? Agree. And whoa, this is so cool. It's taking up the entire screen real estate on the monitor. Nice. Okay, now nothing seems to be moving. We have to see how to activate the phone as a touchpad. Pull down the menu on screen and use phone as touchpad option comes up. Wow, this works really nice. But I'm going to try connecting an external Bluetooth mouse. I'm using the Logitech MX Master, which is quite a good mouse. And it also seems to be working quite well. Eat that iPad, that's how mouse input is supposed to be implemented. Now let's try out multitasking. Opening Outlook. And let's see if we have mail open. Now let me see if I can open up another. Mm, can't seem to open more than one window for mail. Word. Multiple documents. Nope. Only one instance of the app can be opened up it looks like. Not all apps can be opened up uh, using Dex. As the apps that uh, require only touch input cannot be opened up. It doesn't even allow it. USB pen drive also works as I expected it to. This is Android after all. For my T5 SSD, I needed to insert power into the extra USB-C port on the dongle, as it was not able to supply enough power. Let's check out if the Galaxy S8 Plus works the same, as it has been updated to Android 9 as well. So the necessity to purchase a Dex dock is not there anymore. But do note, external USB-C dongles cost quite a pretty penny. But still, what are the price of a Dex dock? If you have an existing Galaxy phone from S8 and up, the Dex desktop experience works quite well. This makes the phone into an even more portable computer you can carry around anywhere. Wherever you go, a monitor, a keyboard and mouse should be enough and all your files are safely stored within your device. There are some features you might miss if you compare it to a full-fledged computer, but if you mostly work with documents, browse internet or access email via your phone, this solution would work quite well. If you have any questions, send us an email at uh, tech at talkingstuff.net or uh, WhatsApp us at 9652578833. So that's it from me. Thank you for watching and see you all next time. Make sure to like this video and also subscribe to the channel. Also make sure to click on the notification bell to be informed when new videos are added.